No point in wasting time. Let's get to work. Let's follow the scientists, Dad. Let's go. Hey there. I hear we have you to thank for getting us up and running again. They sure are taking their sweet ass time. Nice little flip you got there. You should join the Olympics team. Uh oh. What the hell is that? I suggest you comply immediately, sir, in order to prevent any more incidents. James. He's gone. You honor us with your presence here. Well, thank you. Um, everywhere I go, they seem to be saying that. Hello, and welcome back to Fallout 3. We are at the Citadel. It is early morning. And I'm supposed to go see the scribe about access to the computer terminals. I believe that's... I believe that's our, our quest. Yes, ask Scribe Rothschild for pre-war computer access. But, um... I, the, you know, I, I can't do that quite yet, Daddy. I have to go look for the person, and I don't remember who it was, uh, who can train me with power armor. You know, I think that's a bit more important right now, at least for me it is. So, and um, I forgot who that person was. Maybe she Hello. knows? Hello. I hear those Enclave soldiers are equipped with plasma weapons. Lucky bastards. I have a plasma weapon. Would you like to see it? Check it out. Look at this. Look at this model. Look how wonderful that is. Aren't you jealous? So, anyway. Hail. You honor us with your Super presence mutants. here. Enclave. They all bleed hmm. the same. I guess no they can't answer my question. Can you? You ever seen a super mutant's head explode? Uh, yes. Many times. Many, many, many times. You know, I should go explore around here. I, I, it looks like they have target practice set up here. You can go up on the walls. That's pretty cool. Let's go take a look real quick. Since it's early morning, um, the day's just getting started. Kind of curious. I like this. This citadel's pretty cool. It's like a fortress. It's like a fortress. So, can we get in this area? Probably. I don't know if I want to. I don't know if I'm allowed to, so maybe I shouldn't. Can I get up there? I don't know. This is pretty cool. Can I have my hangout here? So we have beds over here for the soldiers. Ooh, three dogs on the radio somewhere. Let's listen to what three dogs talking about. Up next, we've got a public service announcement. Listen up, children. This stuff's important. For all you guys and gals tempted by the thought the of lab. stabbing in the downtown DC ruins, here's a tip. You see, children, the Frankensteins might violently and horrifically rip you to shreds, but only if you're lucky. According Elder to Lion most of our reports friend? on the super mutants, Maybe. they actually prefer capturing their victims and hauling them off to God knows where. Consider yourself officially warned. Now, some music. Music. Okay, let's turn that off. Uh, let's go talk to the Elder Lions. I f Maybe he's the guy that told me how to get... Hey, hey, hey. You have my condolences. Your father was a good man. Thank you. Um... Uh, would you grant me permission to receive power armor training? Hmm, considering the circumstances, I think it would be prudent if you received such training, yes. Speak to Gunny in the Bailey. He will train you in the proper use of power armor. Yes! Fear not, I will send word that I have given my approval. Thank you. You'll find him in the Bailey. I will send word that I've given my approval. Yep, you just said that. Okay. Can you tell me about the outcasts? Uh, I'm assuming he's talking about the Brotherhood outcasts. The outcasts are a result of my greatest mistake. But a mistake I'm proud of nonetheless. 
When I came here, I realized for the first time that the Brotherhood's technology could truly save the survivors in this wasteland. I chose to help them, even if it meant putting the Brotherhood's interests at risk. Some of my soldiers called me a hero. Others called me a traitor. The dissenters left my command, calling themselves outcasts to mock me. I cannot fault their dedication, even if I find them lacking in compassion. Okay. I thought the protection of humanity was part of the Brotherhood's oaths. Only in a very broad sense. The Brotherhood's oaths are to protect humanity's progress. Right. Not necessarily every human. Because they are interested in technology. The outcasts and members of the Brotherhood in other places consider it a waste to protect most people. Well, After all, I kind of say, have to agree. Everyone knows how to make another human, but the secrets to making a P-94 <laughs> plasma rifle are all but lost. Okay, how, how do your remaining soldiers feel about the outcasts? Even now, a year after they left, the wounds of their departure are still sore. Some of my soldiers are angry about it. They see it as an insult to me. Bless them for their loyalty. They're more angry about it than I ever was. Others understand their decision. Sometimes I hear them wondering if they should have gone with them. I can't blame them, but I stand by my decision, and I respect theirs. Okay. So your decision's been worth it. Has it been worth the cost in lives and resources to protect people like you from the super mutant? Sure. You tell me. I suspect my daughter's squad helped save your life. And most of hmm, our recent recruits not really. have come from those we've saved over the years. It's cost us... But we've saved many lives, and made the Capital Wasteland a place where people can live. Yes, I'd say that's been worth it. Okay. Yes. Let's speak of other things. Uh, what do you know about the Enclave? More than anyone else, I dare say. Okay. Certainly enough to know they're the greatest threat the Capital Wasteland has ever faced. The Brotherhood of Steel has encountered the Enclave before, you see. Over 30 years ago, back in California. Then they were led by a President Richardson. Now we've got this Eden to contend with. It matters not now, as before they seek to control and destroy. All in the guise of restoring order. Your father, I fear, was just the beginning. Well, I've pledged my life to destroy the Enclave, I believe. They are a menace. I'd like to know more about the Brotherhood of Steel. The Brotherhood is an old organization going back to the years just after the war. We are but a part of it. What would you like to know? If you're part of the Brotherhood, where's the rest of it? The Brotherhood began on the West Coast. Yep, California, Exists I guess. Exists there still. We were dispatched to this location many years ago. In truth, the Brotherhood of Steel has been struggling for years, both here and back home. Honor, truth, courage. These virtues seem to have little meaning in these troubled times, I'm afraid. Why are you here in the Capital Wasteland? Ah, no. That's the real question, isn't it? Sure. Our orders were, and are, to acquire any and all advanced technology. Mm -hmm. And we have, to the best of our abilities. But when I realized the extent of the super mutant threat, I felt it was my responsibility to aid the people in their struggle against them. Unfortunately, my superiors back west disagree with my assessment of the situation. They feel I've grown too attached to the local populace, and they're right. In any event, the Enclave's arrival changes everything. Hmm. How long have you been here? It's been over 20 years since we arrived, and we've been struggling to contain and eradicate the super mutants for nearly as long. With the arrival of the Enclave, I have a terrible feeling the super mutants 
are the least of our worries. Yeah, this is this is sort of like um, uh, The Walking Dead, you know, where in the beginning episodes, the the mute the uh, the walkers were the threat, but then you come to find out later in later seasons that no, it's really other humans that are the threat, and it's the same here. Kind of agree. I mean, I could take care of the uh, the super mutants. I've killed I don't know how many countless of them, uh, but the Enclave. Well, so be it. All right. I'd like to know more about the Brotherhood. Okay, anything you tell me about the Super Mutants? I already kind of know most. Well, maybe they have some information. Maybe has some other information about Would them. Would you believe? No. It's pathetic, really. Considering we've been fighting those abominations for nearly 20 years. In all that time, all we've managed to do is to contain the threat. Hold them back so they don't overrun every blasted settlement out here. But we don't really know anything. Where they're from, why they've infested the DC ruins. And now here we are, holed up in our citadel. Low on resources, low on troops. It's enough to make an old man so very tired. I wonder if I could join the Brotherhood. I wonder if I'd want to join the Brotherhood. Do I know enough about the Brotherhood to make that kind of a decision? I know that my dad was working for them, or at least working with them, so they can't be that bad, right? So what's the deal with the robot? The robot? What robot? Ah, yes. Everyone asks about the robot. Hard not to, I admit. His name is Liberty Prime. Very patriotic. Built by a very proud nation during a very desperate time. We've had about as much success getting him working as they did. You should speak with Scribe Rothschild. He can tell you more. So they're trying to get a robot working. Interesting. I'm going to see if maybe I can. My science skill is pretty high. Hail. Hail. Okay, so i got to find the Bailey. I don't think it's down here, is it? Uh, I'm supposed to talk to... The Brotherhood is at your service. Thanks. Um, let's go down here and take a look at things. And I've already forgotten who he said. Talk to somebody in the Bailey. Ooh, oh, holy shit! There's the robot. <laughs> I didn't even see it. Uh, excuse hey, me, sorry. Hey, Hail. I'm right over here. I'm like, wow. You're up close to it, and you just don't know what you're actually looking at until you back off a little bit. It's that big. It reminds me. Oh wow, that's freaking cool. Welcome. Uh, that's just a regular scribe, but it reminds me of, uh, the Eggers on, uh, wow. What is that movie? Um, uh, shit, I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head just now, but you know what I'm talking about. Ooh. Ooh. What I wouldn't do to get my hands on one of those Enclave Vertebrates. Hmm. That robot would be freaking cool. Go around the wasteland stomping everything. Stomp out the Enclave for sure. Wow, he's not happy. Alright, alright. I'll see what I can do. Who is this? Uh, that's Scrub Roth Scribe Rothschild. I need to talk to him about access. But, uh... I'm sorry, but I really don't have the time to talk right now. Okay, that... Okay, okay. Ooh, Dr. Lee's here. Alex Dragon. Daniel, the douchebag, is here. These are the restrooms. Brotherhood Scribe. Another scribe. A knight. Lots of scribes down here. Where does this go? Mess hall. This is freaking cool. I can sleep here even. Huh. 
So it doesn't show that I'm stealing if I take this stuff. Not that I need it. I don't really need it. I mean, I could use some more ammo. Definitely. If I have ammo around here, I'd love to uh, get my hands on some of it. Pack of cigarettes. Don't really need a lot of that stuff anymore. I got tons of that stuff back at my, my place. It's in the suitcase. Okay. Huh. Mess hall. Coffee pot that doesn't work. I mean, I guess they use coffee pots for decorations now. I'm assuming. I don't know. Remind them of the good old days. They got a nice cow. I mean, this place is pretty... What is this? Uh, take Elder Lion's personal log. I mean, I guess I could come and look at that later. This is the armory. Who is? Who is? Has been judged. Who? I know the protocols, sir. But the equipment that they stole was Scribe very Peabody. valuable. Our weapons are beginning to deteriorate without. Ooh, they have a cell. Then make do with what you Knight have. Captain Durga. The Enclave's resources, but I'm counting on your ingenuity to make up for that. Yes, Elder. I understand. I'm sure we've got the parts around here somewhere. I wonder what they're talking about. Hey, Quartermaster Durga here, stranger. I have to say, I'm not sure what you're doing in my armory. We run a tight ship, and unless Elder Lion says so, we don't trade with outsiders. Oh. Quartermaster out. Okay. So that's where you can get some ammo, maybe? Or I don't know. That's fine. The elders sent word of your arrival. I am Scribe Peabody. So how do you know about Welcome. me? Welcome. Etc. But the armor now, person I'm really doesn't. Very busy. Is there something you needed? Can you tell me something about the scribes? Indeed, I can. Pay no heed to those headstrong knights with their pop guns and bravado. <laughs> okay. It is the scribes, the scribes who make the Brotherhood what it truly is. The brawn is useless without the brain. Hmm? <laughs> Each order of scribes is dedicated to a unique field. All equally important. All more important than those dim-witted grunts. Sure, and the orders are? Order of the Sword, Order of the Shield, Order of the, the quill, quill, Weapons, Defenses, and Research, respectively. Right, right. So these guys research the tech that they that, that's brought in. You belong to the... Sword, of course. Weapons, my boy. You name it. I've helped someone kill it. Huh. I'm the proctor of the Order of the Sword, you see. Weapons research, development and maintenance, all my responsibility. Okay. Certainly. Uh, any... Hmm. Can someone in the Citadel train me to work? Okay. So, any thoughts on the Enclave? Do you think you could repair my equipment? Ooh. Ha. With my eyes closed. Maybe this guy has some uh, good too. skill. But it will cost you, outsider. That's fine. I got plenty of caps. Tesla armor. How much would that cost to repair? Twenty. Th oh, you can't really do a whole lot with it. Hmm. Oh, you can repair my plasma rifle. Well, well, well. I wonder what... Oh, his repair skill is 19? Are you kidding me? What? 19? 19. So, okay, my Chinese assault rifle you can get... Look, at, I can repair this Chinese assault rifle up to max. You can only repair it up to what? A what? Let's see. In the Elder's name. So these guys don't actually realize... I mean, honestly... If someone like me, someone like Jake, not me, but Jake, comes walking in who can repair equipment. Let's see my weapons. Okay. He can repair it. 
up to damage 30. I can fully repair this thing. Fully repair. And this scribe guy, who's supposed to be smart with weapons, can only repair it to to make damage 39? Mm-mm. So yeah, if 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 someone like Jake walked into my place, I'd be like, uh, you're not leaving until you do agree to work with us. We'll pay you anything you want. So let's go see if we can find a uh, courtyard. Let's see if we can go find the Bailey. The lab. Where's the Bailey? Nice. Who are you? I'll oh. train these marshmallows if it kills me. I found him. Paladin Gunny, let's talk Initiate. to him. Initiate, you've got a lot of nerve to interrupt. Oh, my apologies, stranger. I thought you were one of these worthless initiates. Uh, no. I swear, these kids would be lost without me here to powder their asses. <laughs> what do you do here? I am charged with the duty of turning these maggots into brothers of steel. With the threat of the Enclave, they're likely going to be pressed into service before they've taken the oath. So I've got a lot of work to do. Yeah, I wonder how many initiates they have. Uh, can you train me to use power armor? Heard you were coming. Yeah, I can train you, but don't ask me to like it. My initiates sweat blood, and you just get a free pass? Anyway, you ready for this? Yeah. Now look, to wear power armor, first thing you need to do is relax your muscles. Let the suit do the work, okay? Now you. Perk added, you have received the specialized training needed to move in any form of power armor. Yeehaw! What aid can I offer you, outsider? Excellent. Uh, so, uh, any thoughts? You know what? I wonder what level Gunny is here and how good he is at fighting. I would be willing, from, from the people I've met in this game so far, I'd be willing to bet that Jake is better than he is, has better skill. Killing unarmed civilians makes me sick. Come over here. Try fighting someone who shoots back, fucking cowards. Hmm. I like his attitude, though. Why do you think I ride these initiates so hard? I make training hell, so fighting those uglies won't be. Yeah, yeah. I had to do the training all by myself, you know. Uh, did everything. I learned, I'm all self-taught and everything. Really good, though. Uh, thanks, Gunny. Damn initiates. <laughs> Glad to have met you. Okay. That sounded like plasma. No, that's laser. Excellent. I wonder how many initiates he's training. There are several out here in the courtyard. There are some over here, like, doing hand-to-hand -hand combat. Alright, well, I would like to, um, maybe go get some battle armor on. This, is it the Tesla armor that, that I found that was really cool? That I wanted to wear? I don't remember. I think this is it. I gotta see what this looks like. Oh, oh my god. That looks bad ass. Holy shit. Damn. The Brotherhood's armor look look kind of like it makes his look I mean come on, look at this. Look at this. Hey. Check it out, dude. I mean, compare me to you. I mean, here, let me get over here. There is no comparison, man. No comparison. <laughs> Love it. Love it. 
Alright, so let's go find uh, the... I guess we gotta go to the lab, right? Um, ask Scribe... Right, yeah, Rothschild's in the lab, and the lab is over this way? I believe this is the exit, right? Or is this ring... Ring A? I think that'll that'll work. Lab's down here. Uh, somewhere down here. Need something, friend? I'm going to the lab. Alright, let's talk to Scribe Rothschild. Who was down here a little while ago. Is that you? No. He's over here? The Brotherhood is at your service. Great. Need something? Yes. May I start by saying that I am sorry for your loss? Thank you. I was acquainted with your father many years ago. The world has lost one of its few remaining visionaries. Hmm. How did you know my... Thank you. Think nothing of it. Now, Dr. Lee has explained your predicament. You need to locate some Vault-Tec equipment? Yes. Um, my father was looking for something called a Gek. Do you have one? A Gek? Goodness, no. Certainly not. I must say that there are some who doubt such a device really exists, let alone works. If, however, you share your father's determination, I may be able to assist you in locating one. Okay. So you know where to find one? Now, I remember the Gek is an acronym for... Environmental something. I, I don't remember what it... I think it changed... It, it helps to change... It's like an environmental... It's it's equipment to help process and help with the... With the, with the process of changing the environment. I, I don't remember what it stood for, though. Possibly. I'm afraid I won't be able to assist you directly. The news Dr. Lee has brought will require me to be elsewhere. I can, however give you access to an old pre-war computer from Vault-Tec. It may have the information you need. Great. You will find the terminal in the archives in the A-Ring. Thank you. You are welcome. If you require further assistance, I may be able to help. A-Ring archive. A-Ring. Uh, use Vault-Tec computer in the Citadel archives. Now, we saw the archives. Well, I was in the archives. I saw the door to the archives, anyway. So, it shouldn't be hard to get to it. A ring. Which is over here. Okay, I believe the archives was... Was it this way? Need something, friend? Great Hall. Lab. Yeah, I knew there was an entrance to the lab from the A-Ring. I just missed it. Courtyard. Uh, what is that? Oh, archives. Now, is that... Oh, it's in here. Okay. Hail. Hail. Vault Tech Terminal. That's got to be it. What else is in here? Wow. Hail. Check this shit out. Hail. Hail. Uh, I keep... <laughs> Trapping myself like that. Oh, this is... Okay, this is just to the hallway. Nice place you got here. Pentagon Library Terminal? Holy shit. Project Brainstorm? Mission... Cloacina Report? This is all very interesting, and maybe I'll get to it at some point... But, uh, Max and Archive. Diary? Rothschild wanted those AMS tests. Anyway, right let's away. take a look at the vault Tech terminal. Okay. DC area vault listings. Oh, crap. I gotta go through all this. vault Tech personal assignments. That's corrupt. Order requisition forms. Uh, okay. So, I guess we'll go through these one by one. Uh, 
Oh, wait, hold on. Use the Vault Tech computer and, okay, to locate a GAC. This says Vault 87. But this is all, like, redacted, redacted. Oh, here we go. A GAC. Stand, okay, non-standard equipment. Stasis chamber, plasma containment field, three of them. And a GAC. So I gotta find Vault 87. Great. Can I look at these other vaults? I've been to Vault 92. Sound equipment, mm-hmm. Vault 101, let's see. Let's... Oh, air. Personnel assignments, air. Project goals, air. <laughs> Twelve one forty seven C robots, caretakers, blobs, stasis pods. Okay. So, so now let's go back and talk the the purifier to the scribe. With those vertebrates, they're able to transport personnel at a remarkable rate. Very well, thank you for the update. Lab. Talk to him about Vault eighty seven. See where that is. There you are. Ah. ah, you're back. You need something else now. Yeah, the location to Vault 87. Vault 87 has a GEC, but I don't know where it is. Ah, well, that much I believe I can help with. Step over here for a moment. I'll show you where it is. Okay. Oh, map. Okay. Right. This map shows the locations of all known vaults in the local area. Vault 87 has been highlighted for you. There. Entrance to Vault 87 will be particularly difficult for you, I'm afraid. Why is that? The area is highly irradiated. Lethal levels are all around the entrance. Gaining direct access will be quite impossible all right is there another way you share your father's determination it seems and in this case you are correct there may well be another way vault 87 is located very close to the site of lamplight caverns lamplight it is caverns. entirely probable that the vault may be entered from within the caves uh Okay, well, I guess it's time to find out. So there's a vault down there. You've never bothered investigating it? Don't you know? The Brotherhood simply cannot spare the resources necessary to investigate the area. Perhaps you may be more successful. If you do find anything, please return here so that we may decide how best to proceed. Great, thank you. I wish we could do more, but the Brotherhood potentially faces a very pressing, very real threat in the Enclave. Yes, I know. All of my efforts must now be devoted to assessing the threat they may pose to us. I'm sure you understand. Yes, I do. Okay, search Lamplight Caverns. Where the hell's Lamplight Caverns? Okay, so Vault 80... Oh, it's over here. Oh, this is cool. So Vault 106 is right next to 101. I've been to... Wait, wait, wait. 108? Have I been to 108? I haven't been there yet. Okay. I must have missed that one. Vault 108. I've been to 92. Such a pleasure. Yeah. I have not been to 106... Yeah, I haven't been there. That's going to be a long walk. Okay. I don't know of anything close by there except Evergreen Mills and this garage, and I got to walk up here. 
Well, farther than there. What, why is it showing it here? Oh, this is the actual vault location, but I can get in here. Probably in the caves here. Okay. Search Lamplight Caverns. Lamplight Caverns. Okay. So we got to go to the Lamplight Caverns. Um, hmm. I'm looking into what might be causing the leak. The leak. There's a leak? What kind of leak? Power leak? A uh, coolant leak? An information leak? All right. Can I leave from here directly from here? I have a feeling it's not going to let me. Let's see if we can go to Megaton. Excellent. All right. Well, guess what? It is time to fix up some weapons and get my armor on. I'm going to see... I. <laughs> You know what, that Tesla armor? There's no way I'm wearing anything else. I mean, that, that shit's cool. Isn't it? That Tesla armor? Wow. What else do we have here, though? I want to take a look at some other armor. Power armor, that is. Okay, I'm over-encumbered, but um, that's okay. I, I just want to model this uh, armor, and then I'll put it back. Because some of this I haven't really seen before, so I figured now would be a good time to uh, try on some armor. Here's the Brotherhood Power Armor and the Brotherhood... You were over in... Yeah, I know that. And Brotherhood Power Helmet. Let's see what this looks like. So I could look like, you know, the Brotherhood of Steel if I wanted to. I mean, not bad, but it doesn't have quite the flair of the uh, Tesla armor, does it? Let's see what else we got. Metal armor and metal helmet. I haven't seen this yet. Okay, that's that's kind of cool. I guess I could have rocked that a little bit while I was playing, but you know, eh, it's it's okay. Now we got the regular, just regular power armor and power helmet, which looks still a lot like the Brotherhood power armor. And then we got recon armor, recon helmet. I'm not sure what this is. Interesting. Um, not my cup of tea, but whatever. And then I think there was one, te no, talon. I don't have a talon helmet though. Ew. Their armor sucks. <laughs> and that's it. So I'm gonna put it all back. We are definitely going to be using the. Um, Tesla armor and Tesla helmet. Uh, yeah. That's badass. Just badass. Okay, I'm gonna put all this shit away. And, uh, whoops. And I'm gonna re repair some weapons, and then we're gonna go. We're gonna head on out of here. There's actually one armor I didn't, I didn't look at. Uh, Linden's Outcast Power Armor. Let's see what this looks like. Oh yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. I mean, it looks a lot like the um, uh, the Brotherhoods, but it's a, got a different color to it. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Okay, I have everything repaired. My plasma rifle really doesn't need repairs. It's still... I don't remember. I must have repaired this earlier. It's looking really good, the condition of it. Uh, Chinese assault rifle is almost fully repaired. Combat shotgun looks good. Flamer looks okay. Um, and the sniper rifle, that's all I got. So, uh, And my weight's pretty good. Obviously, this armor is going to weigh a little bit more than the armor I was using. Um... So, you know, here we are. Here we are, ready to go. Um, I need some freaking ammo. So, I'm going to go see... I'm going to go around town. 
What time is it? Do I have to sleep? I do. Let's sleep till morning. Well, isn't this interesting? I looked up Tesla armor. It can only be repaired by other Tesla armor. Who wears Tesla armor? Enclave soldiers. So guess what? I'm going to be doing. Hunting Enclave soldiers. That's right. And I know a, one place I could probably find them. I don't think I have any more Tesla in here. No, I don't. I think, you know, before I actually go to Vault 87... Oh, let me put this armor back. Before we go to Vault 87, I'm going to do a little hunting. I do have a Brotherhood of Steel holotag I'm going to turn in. Uh, is that all? Yeah, that, that that's it. Maybe I should wear some regular power armor before I... Nah, this stuff looks too cool. I wish there were more people like you in the world. I want you to have this. I hope it helps keep you safe. A uh, stem pack, yes, thank you. No, thank you. You're welcome. See you around. All right, let's go talk to Moira and a few others, and then I've got to find out where to find some Monclave soldiers that I can just kill. Need something, friend? You are Hail, outsider. I am Scribe Jameson. Word of your ordeal has spread. I am truly sorry for the loss of your father. But if I can help you in any way, please let me know. You have? Oh, my. This brings to light a sad affair for the Brotherhood. But perhaps it is something that you can assist us with. If you have the time, I have an offer for you. Okay, so I came here to give Scribe Jameson uh, the holotag that I found. Um, it was interesting. I had to go talk to someone on the outside. They said, go talk to Scribe Jameson, and then came down here, and I didn't expect this. Okay, tell me, what's going on? Good. As I'm sure you've noticed, the Brotherhood operates all over the DC ruins, often detached from the main base here at the Citadel. We are short on communication equipment. So many of the groups in the field operate as independent cells, with outstanding orders. Sometimes, I'm afraid that their missions end in their deaths. As Keeper of the Scrolls, it's my charge to write of each Fallen Brother's deeds. Okay, and without radio equipment, you can't keep track of them, or... You can't keep track of your own damn soldiers? <laughs> Yawn. Exactly. A brother fallen in the field may have no one to carry word of his death back to me. In calmer times, we could send detachments and messengers to learn their fates, but with our manpower stretched thin, we have no such luxury. Which is why I must now ask you for your help. Each brother wears a holotag like the one you found. Should you find any of the fallen brethren in the field, I ask that you return their tags to me, so that I might record their deeds in the scrolls. Okay. What are the scrolls that you mentioned? Where can I find holotags? Why can't you send your own people? Okay. Scrolls are kept by the head librarian of each Brotherhood bunker. The scrolls are a record of the Brotherhood itself. Into each scroll is written the name and deeds of each of our brothers. Battles, what technology is recovered, when he was promoted, everything. The last entry for each brother is that brother's death. It is important, as the way a man dies is just as important as the manner in which he lives. And so, each man who nobly serves the Brotherhood ascends into our history to be remembered by those who come after him. We have access to a great deal of technology, and because of that, there are a number of things that we can continue to produce. I will be able to offer you caps for the tags you bring me, but from time to time, Okay, I came over to 
girder shade because I think that's wasn't uh, vault 112 around here somewhere. So I came over to gir I, I basically went and uh, bought as much 556 as I could find. Didn't have a you know I got up to 572 rounds, but honestly I'm I have a lot. I can repair my plasma rifle now. So, and I have a lot more marker fusion cells, so I'm kind of going to switch over to that, I think, for most of my fighting. Anyway, I come over here to uh, find uh, the, the, uh, the Vault 112 because there was some armor there that I wanted to pick up. And guess what I found? Well, aside from the Death Claws, uh, uh, Let's see. It looks like I might have to kill some death claws here first, real quick. Damn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. So. I didn't get to show you what I found. But, um. These are Enclave soldiers. Check this out. And they have the armor I want. <laughs> One shot. Oh boy. How come you don't go after them? Deathclaw. Is this their Deathclaw pet or what? Come on. Where's the head? Where's the headshot? Oh, they got him under mind control. Interesting. Interesting. I gotta kill this other asshole over here. He just got a uh, a laser weapon. No big deal. I'm back up to full health, little bitch. Where'd you go? Yeah. Enclave officer. Let's see. We got some electron charge pack. Officer hat and uniform. Ooh, another a plasma pistol. I have, that's the first time I've seen a plasma pistol. Plasma mine and plasma pistol. That's all nice and swell, but what I'm really interested in is this uh, <clears throat> Tesla armor over here. Hopefully I can still grab it from this goo pile. Should be able to. Yes, sir. Excellent, excellent. Told you I was going to go hunting for some uh, Enclave soldiers. And that's exactly what I intend to do. What is this over here they're protecting? I just happened to uh, run across this by accident. Uh, I was I went to Girder Shade and then I heard some, some uh, Gatling laser fire and I just walked over here and saw it was Enclave soldiers. What is this place? What is this? Huh. I don't think it's on the map. Yeah, I don't really... see anything. Here, we'll take a peek around. Wait, what? Deathclaw cage door. Oh. This is where they kept the Deathclaws and they had them under mind control? Very interesting. What the hell? I didn't know the Enclave could uh, mind control Deathclaws. It's in the crate. Excellent. Got any more of that shit around here? Oh no, it was Smith it was the Smith Casey garage. That's where it was. I'm gonna go back and see if there's remember I wasn't able to fully loot the place. So I wanna go take a peek. Ooh, what's this? I have some rad resistance in this suit, so I'm not too concerned. Oh. 
Baby scorpion. I thought you were dead. Damn it. This place actually is, I think, a little bigger than I... Oh, yeah, than I expected, although... I don't know, maybe there's nothing here. Where's, uh... Hello, sir. Where's Dr. Braun? That's actually who I'm looking for. Um, overseer's office. Hmm. Doors activated. It's uh, it's here, but I don't have a key. Okay. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna look around. I'm gonna look around uh, this vault. Probably in between episodes and see if there's anything here worth taking. Oh. And then uh, when I come back in the next episode, I should be done. And uh, in the meantime, I'm also going to do a little research on where I can find Enclave soldiers to kill. Because that's what I want to do. So. We'll be doing that. And I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for joining me on this one. See you next time.